just simply um, because I am representing the older demographic that's been through, you know, a lot of that with a friend. Um, <laughs> they've been through a lot of the mistakes and I'm still trying to rectify some of those. My, my words to you would just be simply to every time you're with your children or with somebody that you love and the words hurry up are coming out of your mouth, replace it with I love you. Because when I look back and I think about how I herded my kids in and out of the car and we had to be here and we had to be there, there was so much stress placed on them that they couldn't do anything about it. And I think that's very typical of our culture today. So in the next hurry up, replace with and I love you. And I, I think you'll feel a lot better about um, parenting and being part of this world. Now on another note, I'm sorry, what, uh, what's your name? Sarah. Sarah. A lot of the lines of um, getting rid of sentimental stuff and simplifying your life. Um, we can scan things. We can give things away. We can do all kinds of things that make us feel good. Um, I, I've shared with a few people that this, this scarf was created by a lady locally um, with the spoon flower press. Are you familiar with spoon flower? With spoon flower, you can design your own fabrics. And I think you can order like even like a fat quarter. Well, I was at my mom's recently, and for my 60th birthday, she gave me the family hope chest. And I opened it up, and there on the top sat a pair of maroon white polka dot boxer shorts. And I said, Mom, what are these? She said, Your dad wear those on the honeymoon. <laughs> My siblings, something like my sisters will get a scarf and my brothers will get something else. So, just wanted to offer up a suggestion another way to say, hang on to some of those little, little things you just can't part with. Um, I know. Use <laughs> <you're so> <laughs>